All right, so today we're going to look at putting a program onto a PLC and then taking a program off of a PLC. So what I've done is I've taken this little bit of sine wave code copied from our new IAS tech blog featured here. Now we're going to go ahead and connect to the PLC. We're going to go ahead and write and start project with sources that will compile and put the source code onto the PLC. Once we've done that, we'll just check to make sure that the PLC is operating. And as you can see, we are creating a sine wave. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and try and get the program off the PLC. I'm gonna use a program called WinSCP. The host name is the IP address 192.168.4.10. The username is admin. And in this case, I've left the password uh, stock from the factory, which is on the front of the controller. That's 14CCF5F9. All right, now that we're logged in, this is the file system of the PLC. So we're going to go to projects. We are going to go to the current project. We are going to go to SRC, which is source. And then as you'll see, we have a project called SineWave. So I'm just going to go ahead and move that over to my documents folder. All right, so now that we have the program off of the PLC, we can go ahead and open it. So we're going to go to File, Open Project. And I know that I put it in my documents folder in this case. So we're going to go ahead and open the SineWave project. We're going to extract everything from that project. We don't need to save the current project. Now what we've done is we've opened up the project we downloaded off the controller. All right, now that we have the project downloaded from the controller, let's go ahead and go online. Now it should remember all the usernames, all the passwords from the last time. If it doesn't, you should know that. And now what we can do is we can go project and we can go compare online project. Now this is going to compare the current project to the one that's on the PLC. Now, as you'll notice, we got this pop-up error saying that comparison did not find any differences. That means that the program inside of the PLC and the program that you pulled off the PLC are in fact the same. And now that we've verified the projects are the same, we can go into debug mode and then actually watch that sine wave form again.